Let's see if my 400 bucks is in here. Right here, we have a small pole holder, 15 bucks. That's kind of cool. Contractors, work truck set in here. All brand new and wrapped, 30 bucks right there. I love toys. And right here, we got a big wagon. This is a radio flyer. At one time, this was normal, but somebody, they did some uh, pimping out, if you say so. Put some sideboards on it, some pole holders. I put it in my store, $60. Boom! Right here was the main reason I bought this unit. 12 poles, a fishing pole holder like this, 50 bucks. Some of these poles are a little better than the other ones, like normal pole right here, 20 bucks. 10 bucks, 15 bucks, 30 bucks. Usually when you see these kind of bags, it means you got better reels. Oh yeah, this pole right here, at one time it was about 100 bucks, but it's been broken and beat up a little bit. But right under here, I noticed that. Let me tell you what this is, a Shimano Bait Runner. This reel here, oh my gosh, I'm wrong. Shimano 6500. I thought it was the $145 one, but 65 is the $185 one. $100 just on the reel alone. I thank my dad, because he took me fishing off little, and I've been fishing ever since. This is a real man's locker, so it makes sense that I'm the one that got it. Dave thought he was running me up, but I knew I had my money just by looking at a few items running me up my butt. Now, this is kind of cool. That's an iron bank, 25 bucks right here. Every single one of these bottles are full. $80 in liquor right here alone, plus $2 for the crate. I started off super fast, slowing down, but hopefully it'll pick back up. Uh-oh, Xbox 360 and Wii. Ooh, let it all be there. I don't see any of that yet. Here we go. All right. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Another yes. I don't like somebody to see on TV an old Arabian movie there. Ooh, look at it. It looks cool. 15, 40, 15, 10, 40, 20, 20. All these lighters put together, 250 bucks. This pays for the whole unit. Easy. These going right in the passenger seat, right there, with a seat belt. Uh-huh. Like you're my child. That's how I'm going to do it. We got a lantern right here. This is kind of cool. We got like a eight millimeter reel to reel. Put it at 50 bucks. This right here at 15. Let me check out. This. Ooh, this is a weird little metal case. Doesn't feel very heavy. Come on, come on. Uh, looky here. Old lures. Look at that old school propeller. Look at that. That's old wood right there. Look at that. Probably carved with one of these knives. No telling. I know wooden lures are worth a lot of money, and you got seven or eight wooden ones, seven or eight rotella, four or five poppers, a racist one there. Look at this. This actually looks like a live animal down there. If I'm a fish, I'm biting the hell out of that. Some propellers. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pack all this stuff up and find an old buddy that knows about this fishing stuff and find out if they're worth their weight and money. My last couple items of the day is this old antique dresser. $100 price tag on that dresser. $100 on this old headboard. Woo! Ain't nothing like a great day, but the only thing that makes a great day better is taking my lures, going fishing. I'm meeting with fishing expert Lauren Hurst owner of Angling Artifacts, to find out how many clams I can get for this old box of lures. Welcome. How you doing? Yep. Nice to meet you. Welcome to Angling Artifacts. Come on in. Oh, ooh. Wow, speaking of artifacts, I got some pretty cool stuff I want you to look at today. Well, I'm dying to see it. This is what we love to do. All right. We've been dealing in antique tackle for 40 years. Well, let's take a look at what you have. All Maybe right. you have a treasure. So you tell me if I won or if I'm winning. Winning? Well, you've got quite a collection here. The box is pretty loaded. What you have here mostly are bass lures. Made out of? Cedar. A lot of people don't know that to get these scale patterns with the paint, they use nylons. I like that idea. Hey, there you go. Hey, honey, can you take that nylon off? I'm going to do some spray paint. <laughs> Unfortunate thing is that they've all been tossed together. And of course, as we know, all lures have hooks. They tangle and they create damage to the bodies of the lures. That degrades the value of the lure. Okay. The other thing about your collection is that even though this isn't a tackle box, it is a very old vintage box that I would date from the early 1900s based on the construction. In this case, the box is just as valuable as any of the better lures in here. How much would I get? I tell you, I think you could get 100 bucks. Only oh, yeah, hundred bucks? hundred bucks does buy a lot of worms. You know, I ain't gonna lie, I thought I was gonna get a little bit more, but like I said, I'm already up, so I'm happy. Win, lose, or draw. 
Home pick. run. You got it. I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world!